These ladies belong to a club that no woman wants to join, the Jilted Brides Club. My guy was a complete coward. I was incredibly humiliated. I was devastated. 30-year-old Kylie um, Manulak from Tampa was engaged for two years. One week before the wedding, her fiancé dumped her. Can you believe he did it by text? It said something like, I'm not coming home and I don't want to get married to you. How did Kylie heal her broken heart? She joined her bridesmaids in trashing their dresses in spectacular fashion. It was something that kept my mind off of it and kind of brought everybody together. 32-year-old Cindy Masonoff was jilted just one hour before her wedding. Not nice. He embraced me and I kind of pushed away and was like, are you joking? Nicole Contos made front page news when her fiance left her at the altar of a packed cathedral in Manhattan and then had the nerve to proceed on the honeymoon to Tahiti by himself. We couldn't believe that this was really happening. We had about 350 people in the church, the archbishop at the time, we had the choir. But Nicole held her head high, turning her reception into a giant party, dancing to the disco anthem, I Will Survive. You can imagine how devastated these three women were. But now they all agree being jilted was the best thing that ever happened to them. Two years later, on a blind date, I met George. Mm. This is my prince. We are now having our 15-year wedding anniversary. Aww. And we have two girls. As for <laughs> Kylie and Cindy, they both have serious boyfriends, proving you can be happy ever after, oh, even if you end up in the Jilted Brides Club. To moving on. To moving, moving on. on. Better things. Absolutely. Better things.